Okay, in this screencast we're going to have a look at the process of importing um, an alternate application that has been sent to you in an email as an attachment or perhaps you may have downloaded it from um, Alternet itself. An exported alternate application is called a LAR file and it has .lar on the end of the document name. So if you have received the LAR file for this professional development plan, you can save that to your computer ready to be uploaded in your Express space. So we'll go down to um, the global navigation bar and click on the green Express space icon, which will take you to your personal Express space where the portfolio resides. So when we move to the portfolio page, we have three tabs at the top and we need to click on the portfolio tab. That's going to take us to the page where we will import our professional development plan template. So this is um, my portfolio page and we need to add an application to that page to receive the template that we are going to import and that's a publication display in this case. So we need to go down to the global navigation bar again and down to the actions menu with the orange hand, scroll up to add applications and begin to type the words publication display and then we'll see publication display in the menu. Click on add or click hold and drag to where you would like that publication to go. So I'm just going to drop it there underneath my heading and then I'll go and remove the applications menu. Now as I scroll down the publication display appears now just under my heading and links and I've chosen to have the layout that allows that publication display to take up the entire width of the page and that's probably a good idea in this case. So now that I've got the publication display on the page I need to go to the top right corner where the buttons are onto the little config button down to export import and a dialog box will appear that will allow us to import that LAR file. So we click on the import tab and it says where would you like to get your import from, from the desktop or your own computer or from Ultranet's content server and in this case we're taking it from our computer so we need the uh, button for desktop checked. In this case there's a little glitch at the moment and we need to just click on the content server button, go back to the desktop button and then it ensures that it will know it's getting that from our computer. Click on the browse button, search for the LAR file, in this case here it is on the desktop, it's the LAR file for our PDP. Click on open, make sure that that's written there in the line. We're importing all of the data, so we make sure that it's all ticked and that's done by default. And then click on the import button. And that should bring in our professional development plan table or template with all the data ready for us to make a start. Now once that's imported, you can see in the top left, you've got a tick to say that the request processed successfully. And then we scroll over to the right hand side to return to full page. And then we should be able to see that PDP template on the page. So we scroll down and here is the template ready for us to now edit and put in our own information and for our reviewer to begin writing comments and reviewing that um, professional development plan. So that's how we import our LAR file into our Express space.